Today, the Ghostbusters News Halloween countdown continues with the return of Fan Mail Friday. Hey everybody, Jason here at GhostbustersNews.com and as always Ghostbusters News right here on YouTube and like I said at the top of the video, today Fan Mail Friday, it is back and today I'm going to be unboxing two packages. And before I start tearing into those today, as always if there's anything you have that you'd like to send to the Ghostbusters News headquarters, we do have the, uh, the shipping address right down below in the description. Now that I got that out of the way, let's focus in on today's packages, both of which were sent to the Ghostbusters News headquarters from Ghostbusters News YouTube user Bash Crash. 914. If you've been checking out the Ghostbusters news videos here on YouTube for a while, you've probably recognized him. He's the one that uh, uses the, the image of Big Van Vader when he comments. And it must be Vader time because I got two packages here from him. So let's go ahead and uh, start tearing into these today. Let me start with the, uh, let me start with a smaller one. All right, so the first item inside uh, looks to be the bigger of the two here, which it is a Stay Puffed Marshmallow Man apron and chef hat. Now let it be known, I got one of these some time ago, but you know what? I'll never tear down the opportunity to wear a Stay Puft Chef hat. Uh, you know what, I got the chef's hat on, I might as well go the distance, right? All right, so I got the chef's hat on, I got the apron on, and I think right now, like, I gotta find me a grill somewhere, a propane tank, and start grilling me up some burgers. But uh, before I do that, I gotta finish today's Fan Mail Friday. So coming up next inside this, uh, this package here, we've got, uh, oh, this I actually do not have. This is a three-in-one universal mobile wallet. As you can see, it has the No Ghost logo on it there, and it's a wallet, it's a cord keeper, and also a stand. This is actually really cool. Uh, Bashman, I thank you so much for this, and especially this. Uh, I'm absolutely gonna be attaching this to my cell phone right after this video. So cool, thank you, man. All right, so that's all that was in the smaller package. Now let's move on to the larger package here. Uh, let's uh, tear into it. Okay, so we got ourselves a baggie full of goodies as well. Uh, well, it looks like something of like cloth on the inside of here, but we'll get to that later. That's definitely the biggest piece inside uh, this package. So yeah, let's start with this uh, this baggie full of Ghostbuster goodies. All right, so first up, we have got this notebook here featuring the uh, the Gozer the Gozerian like doorway. Yeah, this is the art. This is the door that was found on top of Dana Barrett's apartment building. This is really cool. I'm pretty sure I think this was part of like a Culture Fly uh, Ghostbusters like box set some time ago. Uh, me being in Canada, there are certain like mystery box sets that I don't get up here or if I want to order them online, like I got to pay through the nose for shipping. So I don't have this. So this, this is a big win. Big win, thank you. So after that, we got a bit of an inception moment with a baggie within a baggie here. And in this baggie, we've got uh, a whole pile of stuff. The first thing that catches my eye is this pack of Ghostbusters 2 trading cards. And yes, I can still, yeah, I can fill it in there. The gum is still inside. For those who didn't know, these old like uh, trading cards, they came with gum inside, like old baseball cards. Um, I mean, I'm, I'm sure that's still fresh, right? Right. Also inside of there, we've got a Ghostbusters no ghost patch. Now, of course, I've got countless Ghostbuster patches, but I'm always up for another one. Also included is one of these Ghostbusters No Ghost Buttons, which I'm pretty sure these are from Spirit Halloween. It's a classic No Ghost logo on a button. I mean, what's not to love here? As well, I also received one of these super swanky Ecto-1 pins. Black and silver says, who you gonna call? Of course, has the image of the Ecto-1 there with the caution striping. Now, this one's really cool. I know in the past I have said that I am starting a Ghostbusters patch collection. I think with all your guys' submissions, I I'm starting like a Ghostbusters pin collection as well. Really, really cool. All right, now this is also pretty damn fine. We've got ourselves another Ghostbusters no ghost item, this time being like a little notepad. Or I guess maybe it's like a little drawing pad, maybe like there's no lines on the inside. I'm not too sure the origin of this like little notepad, uh, drawing pad, whatever you want to call it here. Uh, copyright is 2016. So I'm assuming it was released around the time of Ghostbusters Answer the Call, you know, to further hype up that film. Now after that, we've also got another baggie within a baggie. Uh, this time it is... It is a Ghostbusters 2 watch. I'm assuming it's like a custom made job. Now anybody that knows me knows that I like Ghostbusters 2 a little bit more than Ghostbusters 1. I know to some that could be blasphemy, but uh, yeah, I, I really enjoy Ghostbusters 2. I mean, Vigo, Janos, what, what's to hate in that film? Nothing, the river of slime, Ernie Hudson without a mustache, it's all gold. Well, actually, I think I like Ernie Hudson with the mustache more, so maybe that's something to hate. Like someone walking down the street, people are gonna be like, hey, what time is it? I'm gonna be like, it's time for a sequel. Ghostbusters 2. And the last item within the baggie is, uh, this one's actually pretty cool. It's a mask. It's a Ghostbusters, Ghostbusters 2 mask. It's got logos from the both films, like, all over the front of it there. Now, I'm not gonna get too preachy about masks and such, 
But uh, let me tell you, first and foremost, I love this mask. Uh, Bash Crash 914, this, this is beautiful. I'm gonna wear it every day when I go out and you know, I have to interact with, with the public. But hey, let me tell you something. This thing that's you know around the world right now called the Rona, the coronavirus, uh, I'm pretty sure it's killed more people than like Vigo and Gozer back in those films, right? So I mean, this thing has to be a pretty big threat. So you know, just, just put on a mask and uh, if you can find a Ghostbuster mask, uh, all the better, right? Who you gonna call? Okay guys, now that we finished the baggie, there's one more item inside of here and it's it's this big thing, which I can already make out. That's that's like the, the, the top of the ghost's head from the No Ghost logo. That's Moogly's head. Let's uh, let's let's unfold this and, and see what what it is. What the crap? Holy farts, guys! It's a freaking No Ghost logo flag. I mean, are you getting this? I mean, check check this thing out. It's flipping awesome. It's also freaking huge as well. Bash Crash, you outdid yourself this time, man. Like I love like everything inside these two parcels, but this, I mean, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm kind of at a loss for words, but not really because I, I keep talking right now because I'm so darn excited. Seriously, I love this thing so much. I just gotta find a place to put it here, um, but that may be like a future episode, you know, when we do kind of like the full on like Ghostbusters uh, news room tour, which, you know, we gotta do. We gotta do that soon. We gotta do that, you know, sometime this Halloween season, I think. If you want me to do that, let me know, comment down below in that comment section and just say room tour if you want to see a room tour because like every other video I see people saying room tour, I need to see a room tour. So if you'd like to see a room tour, you know, let me know down below in that comment section. But yeah, that about does it for today's episode of Fan Mail Friday. Once again, Bash Crash 914. You're going to comment today. You're going to comment down below in that comment section. I'm going to see Vader. I'm going to get excited because let me tell you, man, you're awesome. And I thank you so much once again for another amazing care package. Well, I mean, two care packages today. Uh, it honestly means the world to me, man. I, I thank you from the bottom, the bottom of my heart. And as I said at the top of the video, if any of you guys out there have anything you'd like to send into the Ghostbusters News headquarters, we have got our shipping address and it can be found right down below in the description. So that about does it for today's video, guys. As always, be sure to subscribe to Ghostbusters News here on YouTube to stay up to date with all the Ghostbusters news. Also, if you'd like to help out Ghostbusters news, we do have a Patreon page. Link to that can also be found right down below in that description. And I will see everybody right back here next time, right here, Ghostbusters News on YouTube.